Siete. Siete. He loves me. He loves me so much. I. That's my Siete. When's the last time you saw him? A day without Siete is a day without Judas. Siete. Oh, siete. Well, did you have something in there? I did. Oh, geez, siete. We were just talking about how siete likes me so much. Uh, hi, baby. Hi. What are you? Shoes. A surprise. She said shoes and a surprise. I don't think she's wearing any clothes. <laughs> Tell me when. Now. Oh, <laughs> Detroit. Oh, oh. <laughs> Look what she got me. It's the the next edition of the trumpet. The next edition. I haven't even opened it. Wait. Look. It's it's got a picture of somebody on it. It isn't that. It, is that that? I swear that's the same. Image that I saw in in a Lvov, Lviv, in the Ukraine, the, the one of Lenin in the park. A beautiful culture in the Ukraine. That it looks like a statue, doesn't it? Or a mummy. Or a, the trumpet, the Philadelphia trumpet. See, she always brings me things. Hi, baby. Hi. I can hardly even wait till it... Chaos by design. Chaos by design. See, now we're talking about a god. They're saying that's a bad thing? Are they saying this guy's bringing chaos and then he's design? I, I thought... Oh, jeez, baby. I thought it was just saying, worshipping him, because we all know that chaos leads to something better, and then to have it designed, I, it seems like a, a Christian a, a God, I'm not even a Christian, there's a lot of Old Testament in there, <laughs> so that means they're just a bunch of people that want everybody dead, I, it makes sense that they would worship him, he's a God, He's brought chaos. Is that Brad Pitt? I was going to say, who's in the bag? Who's that guy? It, I think it's Brad Pitt. <laughs> no. uh, Who is this? He's sitting there grinning because he found out I know why he left Jennifer Aniston. Because she's got a cunt just like a bucket. <laughs> I am not telling you about any night in Reno. Um... Yeah, there's a magazine. We get that's all that's on the front. How are you supposed to know what's going on? Oh, good. There's a picture of war. First page, right there. That gets you ready for the book. Everybody likes shooting something. This isn't incompetence. This is treason. Oh, this has been the worst foreign policy disaster in the nation's history. Don't quote me on that. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. They've got a picture of that guy. I don't see anything yet. Why America really failed. You see, that is one of those things that they talk about people, the way they say things are like, I didn't say anything, but the way they say it, you know, they said it, they're, they're talking to you. And so when that says why America really failed in big red letters, it's cussing at you, saying you're a failure, you're useless. It's saying the worst possible thing. It's it's inviting you to s pull up your bootstraps and get out on the lawn, you know. Breaking the brotherhood. Gosh, see, no wonder they like the Old Testament so much. They seem to spend all their time there.